Hey everybody, I'm your man Dennis Pitsenbarger. We're here at the Performance Racing Industry Show and I'm in the Holly booth with a very good friend Blaine Burnett. How you doing today, sir? Good. You know what? You guys have made such a great leaps and bounds when it comes to swapping LS motors and just about anything from snowmobiles to, to golf carts. I don't care what it is. But now with the new LT1 motor, you guys are really attacking the aftermarket hard. Talk about what you got going on for the new generation small block Chevrolet. Well, obviously, with the LT motor coming out, um, people are going to start swapping that into to hot rods, muscle cars more when it becomes more readily available and cheaper to do. So we want to make sure we have the parts available when people start to do that. So uh, we've got a high ram intake, uh, just like our LS high ram. Um, that's been really popular. It's a modular two-piece deal, lower and in the upper separate. Uh, we've got various tops you can put on there, whether you want to do a 2 by 4150 throttle body, uh, EFI setup, or uh, you want to do something with more of a plenum and a throttle body on the front, you can do that. Um, so we've got various induction possibilities for you that retain the provisions for the factory uh, DI pump. We've also got our LT engine swap oil pan here as well. Um, that blends a lot of the, the similarities from our, from our previous LS swap oil pans. Good steering clearance uh, for your knuckles, things like that, uh, steering arms, as well as factory sump capacity and uh, just keeps it uh, from contacting your cross member uh, when you install it in your engine bay. We're also working on engine swap mount plates, uh, chassis specific stuff. We're also working on F-Body, uh, Firebird and Camaro to swap an LT in those. Um, as I'm sure you're aware, the LT has different mounting pads on the side of it than the LS does, so we can't just carry those parts over and say they work. Um, also, the head angle on those engines are different. Uh, the DI pump sits off the back of the in engine a little bit, uh, some of those provisions there. So it really does require us to go back to the drawing board and, and reconsider some things before we come out with a product. Um, so we've got the high ram, we've got the engine swap oil pan. We're also working on uh, some exhaust solutions as well. Uh, we've got new LT headers for the C7 Corvette, and uh, we're also working on exhaust solutions for the Camaro as well. I wanted to talk too about electronics. You know, one of the things you guys really did make it easy for someone that in the LS family was whether they wanted to go as simple as an, a simple box and a carburetor and a, to go to that way as far as normally aspirated, you guys are also going to probably have that, those type of products available for the LT motor too? We certainly will. Um, one thing that's unique to the LT engine over the LS is the, the factory DI pump. Um, we are going to be offering through Holly EFI a DI controller so you, you can modify uh, characteristics with that aspect of the LT engine as well. Now, do you guys see the LT engine being as popular as the LS platform? Because really, you guys are the go-to place to find anything you want for an LS engine. I mean, you have an entire display here at the PRI show just dedicated to swapping an LS. Do you see the LT being as popular and as successful for Holly and your entire group as the LS was? Um, all signs, we kind of look that way. As, uh, as more of those engines get put into vets, trucks, your, your utility vans, things like that, um, they're going to become more available for people, especially when they start ending up in junkyards when those vehicles have reached the end of their service lives. Um, people can go into junkyards just like they can now and get a 5.3, get a throw some turbochargers on it, and uh, make a lot of power at the track. All right, one of the things Holly did so well is give the products to the consumer as far as accessory drives to be able to swap those LSs into all those cars. What's the solution you have for the LT? Well, what we're offering currently are some offset brackets that will allow you to swap our current LS accessory drives onto an LT. Um, but we are going to be offering those as complete kits for LTs in the coming days as well. Um, so that will allow people to sort out their accessory drive considerations when they're swapping that into their hot rod, truck, muscle car, what have you. So the question is that LS that you built up for your drift car, which we all love and, and love to watch it drive, is there going to be an LT in the future for that one? Uh, I'm still working on the LS. If people want any of your great products and obviously want to see all the new stuff that's coming out for the LT, where do we go? What's the website? Where do we find all the great products from Holly? You guys can find all that information on holly.com or find us on Facebook at facebook.com slash hollyperformance. You heard him, holly.com. He's Blaine. I'm Dennis right here, Performance Racing Industry Show.